This podcast episode is brought to you by Itopia Life Herb House, where cannabis and culture combine for one of a kind experience. Visit them at 10A West Kings House Road, just across on Canadian Embassy. Also, follow them on IG at Itopia Life or their webpage at itopialife.com for the latest info and strains and merch. It's also brought to you by Lulu's Holistics. Follow them on Instagram at Lulu's Holistics. And of course, you can check them out at www.lulu'sholistics.com. And guys, you can use our code THEFIX to get 10% off your next purchase. That's the fix <laughs> to get 10% off your next purchase. Also, have a big up JR Business Solutions. Get your high end phones and electronics from JR Business. Good customer service, unbeatable deals, quality products. Follow them and get 5% off your first purchase and tell them, say, how the fix did say. No, you say all them things, oh, I say, <laughs> legit. Big up J Alt Business. Also, have a big up. Lothian's Boutique. Follow them on Instagram at Lothian's Boutique. And you can check them out at 23 West Trade Way in Portmore to get your bundles and your wings. And they got makeup and they got hair accessories, everything. So go and check them out, 23 West Trade Way. Thank you, guys. Shout out patrons, DB and Tamagoda. Of course, go cop that fix merch. People get the black tee with the white logo. Of mm. course, you see them? Blue tee with the faded logo, the fix mask, the fix mug, as well as the fix things merch. Now, up on the site, that teespring.com slash stores. Slash. <laughs> You're actually the doing fix better with the slash. Yeah, because I take my time. We don't switch it up. <laughs> Beanie Man and Crystal Tomlinson Rig up. Oh. Mm. Crystal Tomlinson <laughs> took to Instagram and gave a nice classy post with a classy picture mm-hmm. to announce to the world that she and Beanie Man gal them sugar the doctor Beanie Man the king of the dance hall why are you using all are no longer monikers. an item. Seriously? Seriously? We get it. <laughs> <laughs> Jobs, I'd like you to oh read. God. Yo, just carry your glasses. Yo, you know some more time I call for you read shit, you know. You know ah. so this is going to be a reading podcast. We have some shit for read. Just carry your glass. Just have your glasses and on hand. And they're over there, man. City, you know. Jaja. Them they're over there, so. Yo, what them there? But now I go feel Yeah, go read this. No. All right, I read it. All right, can read it like Crystal, because I read Uptown. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go into my other hands, you boys. Five years and folding. Part of growth is knowing when things have come (laughs) to an end. Knowing not to force it. Knowing to let it be. Leaving while there is still love. And not waiting until it's dry, empty, and full of animosity. She continues saying, Knowing to choose peace. And trusting that all things. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, I'm giving I'm giving this to you. I'm giving this to you. Work together for our good. I remain silent for a while on this question, not to keep a secret, but to get clear, certain, and centered. What do you call uh, the literary device there again? Um, alliteration. Yes. Mm-hmm. All right. Thank you for that dramatic reading, You're Ari. Welcome. The post was as dramatic <laughs> as snap, you made snap, it. To, snap, to, to, snap. Right, I'll give it that one. All right. You know, subtext. You have to read subtext, you know? And uh, Beanie Man put out his own um, statement. Single, free, statement. and disengaged. And um, video um, on the whole matter. Yeah. Um, Seriously? <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Me and I broke up. Yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 so, yeah, yeah, so Crystal yeah, Tamlin. No longer together. And uh yeah. yeah. No she man looked like he was in the middle single. of conversation. <laughs> and he's single. like yeah, yeah. He's like, uh, yeah, he was yeah. in the middle of our conversations, like, just oh yeah, that, that's something there. Yeah, come yeah, yeah, the yeah that, that's something. There. <laughs> the, just Yo, the, come to the video. The, the contrast between the two posts <laughs> yeah. was so hilarious to me. I'm like, she was so dramatic and well thought. Mm-hmm. I was like, yeah. But then I was ah, look at that. Ah, we don't. All right, cool. So back to what we did. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, that's how it seemed. Ah, oh, god. The one thing that was definitely revealed to me 
it was not she who was a in video person all this time. Like every other Monday, we used to put out a, a video at a or something. Or go on. Yeah, it Poor wasn't Crystal. her, so that was revealed. Care or don't care, ladies. I don't know what to feel, right? That's something like part it, of me is just feel. like it's inevitable, right? Like Thanos, like it's inevitable. <laughs> yes, let the head flow through you, Ari. But let it flow. I'm just like, oh, my little son. Like, oh, like, you know. Oh. You have to be, yeah, isn't it? It's appropriate to be mournful. Why? Or sharing someone's grief. Because, I mean, when you break Is up it with. Grief, it seems like yeah, when you're, good yeah, terms. when you break up with. Some, it, I mean, you break up with somebody is never good. Eh? You're with a person for five years. That's mm-hmm. a long time. It's not easy to separate especially when you have a kid yeah she did say something about letting her story be told or something like so that's so. just check that real quick let's just check that real quick <laughs> oh that, that's the last part that yeah. was missing read that and that's what i said <laughs> i'm clear i'm certain I'm centered. Mm-hmm. This chapter on love, written with love, is closed. It was written with love. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm sorry, we fucked that up, Krista. We're sorry. Um, so it seems like things are on, are on good terms, I guess. Yeah. And that's not easy for those, so. It's not. <laughs> well, again, again. Especially with all the, the let's subtle give it shade a month. being thrown. Mm-hmm. All let's about. give it a month. <laughs> let's give it a month. see the shade being thrown. No. People come in and say a beanie had a problem. <laughs> Clearly, me get it now. Say a beanie had a problem. Everybody so, put... the saying less sometimes mean more. Mm-hmm. That post, of course, mm-hmm. after the whole thing. Mm-hmm. And then... Um, the pretentious. Yes, the tweet the that he made day. is pretentious. Mm-hmm. Word of the day, pretentious. Who said that she? Beanie man said that. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Well, ain't that some shit? Is it? Why? You see, you see, that's the that's the weird thing about doing everything now. Because Egg, everything is going to be pointed to them. Exactly. Mm-hmm. And it's just like, can and I just be? Is, I'm and, over and here. No, like, but the thing is, they, they must know that. <laughs> That's why you cannot blame fans for drawing certain conclusions. True. Because when you're going to put out these cryptic things after this big announcement ha- happened, of course, people are going to tie it back to, to that thing and say, oh, ah, Crystal Yata. You see me? Anything she posts, ah, oh, I mean, Yata. I mean, it could be like Amari, because Amari's been trying to get his attention. <laughs> so you think... I'm just I saying. don't think... I don't think Beanie Man... Well, I don't think for- Beanie <laughs> Man thinks... That Amari know mm. what that word mean. So, <laughs> I don't think it's for Amari. <laughs> Bro, die. I don't think so. I'm joking. Oh, Yo, let's just God. ask. Let's just address the elephant in the room here. But I hate when you no go answer. The two are as woman. What did am I Crystal, doing? Was this relationship an effort to further her political career? This goes for you especially, Miss. I mean government (laughs) (laughs) and i love politics and i love politics Politics was this a move to further her political career who you think gained the most from this relationship hey i asked that question before (laughs) yo what you really think though um well clearly crystal benefited greatly from the relationship Mm -hmm. um you know people if they had actually gotten married, it would have mean more for mm-hmm. her internationally. Um, but to further her political agenda, that's a question. And that is something that could be explored. Mm-hmm. So like, right no, I'm just just opining, you I know. Mean, it happened right after the election, you know, like the yeah, election, three months after ele- loose, three, four, yeah. She never get a seat. Yeah, and that whole letter off with you know, mm-hmm. change or die and all them something there. Yeah, the threatening like, basically the party leader yeah. for cut. And yeah. where I give you thirty days. <laughs> Opening this letter, um, you live 30 um, days or die. Spooky, like, yo, that was a spooky little letter, you know? <laughs> 30 days. <laughs> you was a blood clot. You are done. <laughs> <laughs> that's all it. <laughs> yo, that's, uh, yo, I swear I heard those effects when yo. I saw that letter. 
hate you guys so much. <laughs> 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 spooky sound effects. Man. Yeah, so she's she, she's mm-hmm. not having she hasn't well. But last year, late, like, especially after the election, she really wasn't having the best time. She's um, getting dragged, man. She's getting dragged. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, you know, maybe people, I saw somebody say, like, not even Beanie Man could make her more likable to win the seat. That's like weird. Yikes. But, but, Ouch. but I think... I don't know, like well she I thought she 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 definitely entered into the relationship to gain. I don't know if it was to further her political agenda. I don't know if that was in it. Maybe she have a five year plan. Yeah, maybe that was mm. it. She That's so like sad. Very, she seemed like, like I'm very upset. Press her what affair think. Like she did she did want this fuck. No. She going there with her aim and plan say yeah. oh, this But then I don't but then the thing is when you're from the outset, it's so easy to say some shit. Because mm-hmm. you really don't know. You don't, and you know. don't know people's whole yeah. um modus operandi, you don't know like people genuine thoughts and affection Mm -hmm. so maybe there was i mean of course there was love there Mm -hmm. because things could have even shake you from before the election and now she tough it out because you could have have fooled me because just october i remember being in our interview I must say, no, everything is nice. Magnificent. And mm-hmm. everything is so great. Mm-hmm. And all you know, I say everything bad. I and then interview. she did repost it and say, yo, <laughs> oh, we hardly have any disagreements. And the only thing we disagree about are the toilet seat being up and all them. <laughs> oh, all is, so, all is so well in Pleasantville. <laughs> That's the name of the podcast. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's the name. Oh, uh, God. So, so much can go wrong in, in three months, four yes, months. Yes, yes. Mm-hmm. I chew that still. Yes, like sometimes it's just some things like just get worse and worse. And and again, she, she suffered a really, um, I wouldn't say like massive defeat at the polls, but it, she she lost. Mm-hmm. And, you know, especially, and again, it wasn't after massive, that, but it was, it was decisive. decisive. Yeah. It was decisive. And the, the, the goal, the letter after too. So mm-hmm. she probably was in a place of depression yeah. that she probably couldn't muster herself out of, and then probably the man is just like, well, like I don't know what to do, like, yeah, oh, hey. and like everything he do was just so annoying to her. Mm-hmm. So you know, you maybe said, things like, oh, she could take up a man like being you have so much pick me and all them things. I'm I subscribe mean, to those views. No, no, love, I love. If you love, no, I'm not. What, no, 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 say, no, no, I'm not like that. Not <laughs> fuck that love, I love shit. No. <laughs> You but said that I was a shit eat love. I, and I said I do. <laughs> <laughs> so if him have five feet, me, but you really. But the thing is, Beanie Man is a different person. Beanie Man is a, a, a world class <laughs> entertainer. He he would, you would hope, have the means to take care of the kid. Maybe he would be spent emotionally mm-hmm. to kind of invest in the emotional um aspect of their ch- of the children's lives. Yeah. yeah. But you know, like. He's more than capable of financially taking care of the children. So it's not technically too much for him. And again, he can't always have all the kids over at one point and say, hey, I'm having y'all for the summer. Come and, you know, form a connection. So he could. You think that. um... So to answer the question, it's not too much Mm -hmm. because it's like, is it too much? Like depending on the person, Mm -hmm. two kids for you, Nara, is too much. One kid probably. (laughs) It's too much. Don't talk about my unborn children. Oh, God. I'm just saying, Don't like, you know, it's probably too much for you. But for being a man, like, 13, maybe. You think just... maybe they had a difference in goals? People I, are that's already, what I was people thinking. People are already opining that, you know, mm-hmm. she was the one who was pushing the marriage agenda while he wasn't with it. Well, we Whether they're even really engaged, yeah, I don't even and know. You can't, I and again, some... we, we really need to stop overstep. We don't know. We don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but people message the opine about that because in Michael message where I say yo, I'm single and disengaged and she's single and ready to be engaged. So it's like people are reading to them like a thing, oh. they're not like a word in there and say, hmm. <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> ah, ah. Uh, yeah, that's a fair. Ah, ah, and that would ah. raise the next question to you know, like how long women, how long would you stay in a relationship before you decide, say, yeah, go cut if him don't ask for Mario. You know, the people them start dig up to. Yes. You know, oh, let's talk them. about that. Him old tweet them. Him Her old tweet. Tweets. Her old tweets. <laughs> Can you read these jobs? 
Let's see it. Beanie. <laughs> That's the <dangerous. laughs> <Thank> you. <laughs> Beanie, you're bitter. Bitter. I just born and know say big dirty thinking Shaba is the boss. <laughs> Give credit, man. Sure. So what was this about? And this was 2012. Uh-huh. Scroll. Scrolling. Mm-hmm. The wicked Islam cleared up this misunderstanding real quick. Oops. You see what's in those clips though, right? She not uh, see. That? <laughs> She's not <laughs> She not <laughs> see. Eh? What am I missing in these clips? Just don't pay attention to vibes cartel. Pay attention to the others. Oh yo. Oh, she look different, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I never know that, you know? I don't know if the tropics did not imply that she's a sleeper agent sent by Vibes Cartel. How want to find that tweet? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I think of that I didn't even know it is that lead. It's either that or never say, oh. And this is what I'm just saying that maybe the people have <gasps> said that maybe she just sleep up her way and yeah. whatever because she had enough of herself in her music. And you know the people have got talk and all these things. But she was always seem to be very much into dance because she, she did like, mm. like did a host some other things. Yeah. Like wasn't she like hosting something? Yeah. Like she did, I know she was hosting the boxing thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was at and one point. And else. In time. She, and I knew it was Nyaming. Mm-hmm. And what else? Other stuff, of Other course. Stuff. Other stuff. <laughs> but I'll just say this in Wait. regards to this. I we work with somebody that used to work with Beanie Man, and that person <laughs> said that yo, we put up with enough things, enough artists, mm-hmm. but we couldn't stand her. <laughs> <laughs> I said, me wow. know what did, but I could not put up with it. Yeah. And this person puts up with a lot for real. Yeah, mm-hmm. the person is, pr- pr- is really quite patient. Really patient. And the man said, I could, I could not do it. <laughs> I could not. <laughs> so take from that what you will. The, oh, enough good. people have only to say about her out there. Mm-hmm. I can only speak from what I have seen. Can I uh, ask a question? Sure, go ahead. Why women always get like a raw D when them overly ambitious overtly ambitious you know well, we are conflate issues here you know because mm-hmm. because i think her her knock is that you know she's very her goal is to be someone that is great and mm-hmm. you see it's very clear from her social media and i don't think i'm saying anything out of turn here like her goal is to be a very influential, powerful woman you in get Jamaica. That. Yeah. Like clearly. I don't think I'm she seems, out of turn. She clearly driven. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Clearly. So but you know it's if that always... letter they never tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> 30 days. <laughs> you know? So you know why why it always feel like a women get women get knocked for Let being overtly you. ambitious. Let me tell you, and it's a fine line. Uh, these are why I have to give it to women more time and say I'm not for I have to be sympathetic and empathetic with mm-hmm. and apply it more time. Because I find line of a balance. Mm-hmm. I'm a no say more time with Uno. Uno. Like even, for example, a, a Crystal Tomlinson, maybe she sees that and recognizes that. And because she does, she don't know how to gauge herself. So she end up putting on too much that doesn't need to be there. Mm-hmm. Hmm. You know, that's like, yeah. and, and I see that happen enough time with woman because they know that to 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 be that boss bitch, they have to, you see me, break mm-hmm. couple eggs and step on couple people. It's like them just all deed sometimes. Yeah. Like, but them some women don't balance. know how to find that balance. Yeah. You see me? I, I me know say, me know say it's a difficult thing with woman because, yeah. Mm-hmm. Understand the plan. So you talk up for yourself and you know say something. You're yeah, a bitch and, and and exactly. You're, especially like, black women, especially yeah. in like black women in in, in America. Mm-hmm. But you have to find that balance. Mm-hmm. You have to. And sometimes I just feel like even would she sometimes she kind of old sometimes with mm-hmm. her personality and trying to appear to be 
is him this boss bitch. Yeah. You know? Mm. I think, no, I think That's she me. appears to be too perfect. I think And I'm it sure is. she will say, I've never, I've never presented myself to be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> You know, that's what I've always said. Because <laughs> oh, she was supposed oh, to be God. framed as this woman that was supposed to tame Beanie Man and, you know, be I this. I mean, that like, there were press really, releases. Yeah, mm-hmm. like to tame I fixed Man. Beanie's life. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I got him to stop smoking. Right. I got him to lose weight. You're right. I, I changed his life. That. Yeah. I so, am Alian Lala. <laughs> <laughs> Why why you have to bring Ian online? I've paid you. Why I you have mean, to bring Ian online? You know, I knew that was our PR and shit. Wow. Yes. It's like, it just appeared to be too perfect. And I think that is it. Like, the, mm-hmm. like it, everybody's like, wait, how something perfect can mash up? Hmm. That's for sure, people. You know, they can fake it for so media. long. I'm never putting out a press release about my relationship. Never. I changed her life. <laughs> I'm never putting out a person who I've broken up with somebody in my life. Right? Yeah.